good morning everyone welcome back to my channel it is sunday i'm getting ready because i'm gonna go to brunch this morning and i'm also gonna go to the flea market which i'm excited about because i haven't been to the flea in a couple weeks and i'm in the mood to get some fun jewelry you guys know i'm like in my fun jewelry air which i'm gonna put a lot on in a minute but i'm gonna do my makeup so i figured i would just chit chat with you guys i kind of want to try out some other products today or like do my makeup differently than I was doing it the past couple days. I say that and it's gonna be the exact same. Please look at this e.l.f. primer. Like, okay, no. Please look at this e.l.f. primer. This is like actually, this is, I'm not okay. I'm gonna be using the last literal two drops of this right now on my skin on Sundays. It's like my favorite cleaning day as you guys just saw. I was like cleaning all morning. Now it's like 10 o'clock. And we're gonna go and get brunch and then go to the flea. But before we leave, I was like, I just really want to clean all the stuff in the house. On Sundays, I normally take a couple hours out of the day. And normally, I take like the full day to clean, but I only had a couple hours because I wanted to go out today. And I like scrub everything like the shower, the toilets, the counters. Like, I picked a day of the week because I feel like when I leave it up to just like, oh, like whenever I feel like it like looks crusty, I wait weeks. And then my house is like, it just gets so dirty so i decided on every every sunday i have the same routine so i like wash the same things i always i wash our sheets every sunday i feel like people wash their sheets and their bedding and stuff like every couple days and i just don't like sorry so i wash the sheets on sundays and i scrub all the countertops and like kind of reorganize for the week. So that's what I did this morning. Also, my sunburn, as you guys know, I'm Larry the Lobster. Uh, it's turning into like a beautiful tan right now. So I'm hoping that it won't start to peel. Like sometimes my sunburns will start to turn into a tan and then like a couple weeks later, they'll be like peeling all the way down my back, which might happen. We're gonna hope for the best. Brandon is literally starving and wants to kill me because I told him we would leave a lot earlier this morning, I guess, and here I am just now getting ready. Not using self-tanner and like doing my makeup to just match like what my skin is and naturally tanning, naturally tanning, naturally tanning is actually a challenge for me. Like I'm so used to my like face being such a different color. I also have two huge freaking pimples. I think I'm supposed to get my period in like four days. So that's probably why. I've got two products here that I could use. This one is the YSL New. This is the Bare Look Tint and this is in the shade, I'm gonna say NU4, shade four. And I think this is gonna be my shade. This is my favorite because I just literally draw it on my skin. We're going this morning to our favorite place to get our favorite breakfast burrito. It's the best breakfast burrito I think I've ever had in my whole life and I wish I could tell you guys where it was but I'm genuinely scared of people going here like I shouldn't even talk about it because I am not going to tell you guys where it's from but it's so good and it's life-changing yesterday there was like some event that was on the street kind of close by where I live and so my apartment building literally does this thing where they will lock the residents inside the building for like an entire day so from 11 to 5 yesterday they sent out an email and they were like you will not be able to leave the building um it's literally like insane like i've never lived anywhere where they're like you actually like can't leave your building if you want to go somewhere you need to figure out like the day before like okay drive your car and stay somewhere else or like put your car in a street that's like a couple blocks over and then a walk and go get it the next day because you literally can't leave so yesterday i sat in my home all day i edited two vlogs which you've already seen but i edited and then i did some work for twin flames and i just started watching the season of love island because i've been seeing so many good things about it like i know this season the drama is so good so i was like i really need to watch and like catch up but i'm only on episode five so i'm pretty much screwed I think I'm gonna start like skipping over some episodes just because I know how Love Island, like I know how Love Island works. I've watched every freaking season. I know that there are episodes that I can skip. Like there are some times where I'm just like, this is irrelevant. So I'm gonna probably start skipping episodes. That way I can catch up to like current TV. I'm also wearing a hat today and I hate doing my makeup like super cute and then it takes all my makeup off like on my forehead because I'm gonna wear a hat. 
but I really wanted to take a picture in this new hat. It's a Twin Flames hat that's coming out this summer. We're probably gonna launch these like in a couple weeks. I have to plan the photo shoot and stuff for it. Also, I'm just gonna tell you guys like this little baby tee that I have on, it's like literally a simple black baby tee. I am just such a basic girly and I just realized like, I was like, I really feel like we should make pieces that are just, just literally simple and can be worn like athleisurely if that makes sense like you can wear these with our sweats or you can just style them however you want them and i just really wanted plain i just really wanted plain pieces just because like i'm that way i feel like we have gotten to a place where we do a really good job making like designs and stuff like that like we work really hard at like our concepts and like our designs and putting out new stuff i feel like there is room for us now to do things that are just simple okay i'm also going to try out this product this is by ysl this is the halo tint highlighter oh okay okay oh my gosh i have the tiniest amount of this on this is so pretty this is the gold shade i've gotten a couple comments recently um of you guys asking me to do like more book videos and like talk about books that i'm reading and stuff like that what exactly do you want to see like do you want me to talk about what i think about the books do you just want me to share my favorite books like overall just like a big like book video about all the books i've read genres and stuff like that i like don't know where you guys want me to start with that but i obviously i love reading and i've gotten really into it within the past year and it's been really really fun and so i'm like i would love to share that with you guys i just don't necessarily know like where to start Oh my god, what is wrong with me today? Yeah, I definitely have to be starting my period soon because I am having like a heat stroke. Like whenever it's like right before, I'm not kidding. I'm like so hot. I'm sweating. I get heat flashes so bad. I told someone that, like I told my friends that. I'm like, yeah, no, I like go like in and out of heat flashes when like right before or like while I'm on it. And they were like, that's menopause. I'm like no it's not don't start with me my new lip combo which i shared in my other video but it's the same i mean it's the same lip liner it's the rare beauty wise lip liner we just outline the lips and then i've been using this this is the summer fridays lip butter balm i really like this because it's moisturizing it smells good <laughs> tastes good and it has a tint which is the perfect combo for me so anyway that's the makeup. There's a lawnmower outside. Let's just pretend that that's not the case. My hair is crazy because I slept on it so nuts. But this is the necklace situation, and I'm going to show you guys the hat. <laughs> oh, my God. Look how cute it is. It's so freaking cute, and I just really wanted to wear it today. So this is the outfit I'm wearing, a plain baby tee, my belt it's from Zara, my Good American Jeans, Converse, and then I have a bunch of necklaces on. I think I need to decide on earrings i think i just want to do little gold hoops today because you're not really going to be able to see them this is my favorite bracelet combo all of my favorite bracelets they're from lisa goslin jewelry they're so cute this one is like the little evil eye um and then this one's just like gold this one's the smiley face one and i like them because they're stretchy so they're so freaking cute You know what I really want? I want the ones that are like two tone. Two tone. Yeah. That's so cute. Hi. 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 Hi
how does it look? We're Looks good. adding what, what to you the gonna, stack. What are you going to put in there? What I'll are you put, put in a there? cute photo of us in the locket. What a sled. A little Wait, trimming of your beard. Yeah. Jordan, give us a quick haul. What'd you get? She got a cute got little, little top. Harley Davidson. This bracelet. Oh yeah, I didn't even get to see the bracelet. She yeah. made a little charm bracelet. Yeah. That's cute. And an engagement ring. Period. <laughs> Hi everyone, I'm back from the flea market. I'll give you a quick little haul. Um, I got three things. The first thing I got, obviously I showed you guys. I got this necklace, it's this little locket. How cute is this? I'm gonna print out a photo of me and Brandon. Oh, I can't open it. I'm gonna print out a photo of me and Brandon and put it in there, but the guy was like, it looks really cute with the stack that you have on, you should get it. Of course he's gonna sell me on it because it's his store. Um, and then I got two things. So I told you guys I love to find vintage Disney stuff. So I found this big oversized t-shirt and I think it's so cute. It just says Mickey and Minnie on it and it's just like a vintage 90s Disney shirt. This is literally it, and I think it's so cute. And then, everyone was making fun of me because I got this, but I just wanted like, I don't know, I like it oversized. This is like a cute oversized sleep sweatshirt. It's a polo, like Ralph Lauren, like whatever sweatshirt, and it's just navy. This is how big it is though. Like this is cute, this is like a vibe. I also was debating on if I wanted to cut it to like be off the shoulder like a little I don't know moment so those are the three items I got I got a necklace and two of these little shirts I'm gonna throw them in the washer right now that way they're not crusty and then my camera died um but I'm gonna go over to Sheila and Poppy's we're gonna read and hang out listen to music and catch up for the rest of the day it's like three o'clock so I'm gonna change because I'm sweating it's so hot and that's what we're gonna do okay I'm here at Sheila and Poppy's which used to be Sheila and Natasha's, and now Poppy lives here because Natasha moved out. So it's like, I've been here before, but I'm getting a whole new tour because it's redecorated. So they're gonna show us the vibe. Guys, this is really cute. Yeah. Last time I was here, I've never seen anything on this balcony. Oh, there like, was never. There was oh, never, there was never anything, so right? No, no, never. We, we had an You guys, <gasps> look at this table. Where is this table from? I drove all the way to Costa Mesa on Facebook Marketplace. Oh my God, Sheila, this is so cute with the little chairs. I'm obsessed. Wait, I'm obsessed with this. Yeah. Those are our little seedlings Look at that we're growing. That's birth the lettuce plant. <laughs> I'm here at Sheila Poppy's. Obviously, I just give you a little bit of a apartment tour, but I just went to Mother's for the first time, which is a grocery store, and Poppy and Sheila love it. So I picked up two things that I wanted to try from the grocery store. The first item I got, these are almond date rolls. So we're gonna see how those are. I like dates and I like almonds. So we'll see. And then I also got these cookies. Wait, this is such a niche reference. I don't know if you're gonna understand what we're talking about. There used to be this episode, I think, of Scooby Doo, and he would eat, he was eating like so many egg or spring rolls. Like, <laughs> hold on. I have to look it up. There used to be this episode of Scooby Doo that I would watch. Like, it was like a VHS, and he was eating like so many spring rolls. Like, you know how they love food? <laughs> yeah, Shag and Scooby. Wait. Oh my god, I have to find it. Because now I'm going to lose my mind if I made that up. What if I dream that? I'm going to try this date. What if, if this is bad? <laughs> Here we are. Yum. The silence is killing. Mm -hmm. Really? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's good. Sheila cut us up some watermelon, and I have put Poppy onto some tahine. <laughs> it is my favorite thing on the planet. <laughs> she's never had tahine, and we went to the beach a couple weeks ago, and I was like, you have to put tahine on your fruit, and now she's obsessed. She's calling all her friends in England. She's like, have you had tahine? No, like, no, do you know what she tried Listen today? to this tahine. <laughs> listen to this tahine. What did you try said. today, Pop? My sister goes, what's tahine? I tried, oh, um, uh, Fritos, um, Chili. Pie. Oh, like a Frito, Frito pie. pie. Frito pie. She said, is this the equivalent of uh, me trying a corn dog? A corn dog. Mm. That's the next on my America list. You've never had a corn dog? Nope. Oh my God. Well, when we go to Disney, you should oh. get, that's where you need a corn dog because mm -hmm. the corn dogs at Disney are so good. And a churro. Have you ever had a churro? Yeah, and the churros. I've had a churro. Um, yeah. Devin gave me my first s'more like two years ago. A s'more? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. 
I guess I just feel like those things are universal. Mm -hmm. I didn't realize like we only have those things. What do you feel like is like the weirdest thing that we have here? To my dad, I go, what's a small? What's like the weirdest? Like, what is like something here that you're like, this is really strange. Like, we definitely like, we would never have this. The Frito pie and the corn dog. <laughs> the Frito pie and the corn dog. The Frito pie <laughs> Wait, did you eat it in the bag? Was it in the bag at the place? In the bag. It's like in the cart? Yeah. Yeah. I was like, and it cost like three dollars and fifty cents. No, I love a good Frito pie. It's, it's, it's because you guys start mixing. It's like you've all smoked weed and you're all high and you all start mixing all this food. But you know what it is though? Like people always say like everyone in America is like overweight. It's like the food that we eat is like insane. Like corn dogs and Frito pie. Yeah. It's nuts. Hey. Alright, say goodnight. Good night. I'm leaving. I made them watch my fault on Amazon. And um and, and now Sheila's life is ruined. We're all in jail because we all have a new crush that we couldn't afford. I, exactly. I don't have room in my mental for this. For another crush. It's too much. Say goodnight, Pop. Good night. I love you. <laughs> love you. I'm back from my facial at Heyday. I'm wearing my cute set that I got yesterday. It's very bright for me. You guys know I literally just wear black and white. So I'm kind of obsessed with the fact that I've got like this pink little set on, but look at my skin. It literally feels so nice. She did some extraction, so that's why there's like a couple little spots where I had like bigger active pimples, but overall my skin feels so freaking good. She did this like nano, I don't know, suction thing on my skin. So it's supposed to help with scarring. So she did it on like the scarring. I have mainly like my scarring is here from when I had really bad acne. Um, so she was like, I can do some stuff for that for scarring. And I actually think I'm gonna go back once a month. I really enjoyed it and I liked my girl. I had Annie, shout out to Annie. I think I'm gonna go back to her and I'm gonna do it once a month. So I did like this little red light therapy to help with scarring and just like hydration. She did extractions and I really enjoyed it. If you guys live in LA and you guys need like somewhere to go for facials. I really liked it, so I'm gonna go back. But anyway, I'm back home and it's like three o'clock now. I'm gonna sit and get back to work and that's pretty much it. I have a very, very slow day today um, just because Mondays are always the slowest. So I'm gonna do some work, eat a little snack, maybe I'll make a smoothie or something and that's pretty much it.